Welcome to an example on how to use the T84 TVM solver in order to determine the present value of a payout annuity. In this example, you want to be able to withdraw $35,000 each year for 15 years and your account earns 5% interest. How much do you need in your account at the beginning? How much total money will you pull out of the account? And finally, how much of that money is interest? To access the TVM solver, we press apps, enter, enter to access the finance menu, and enter again for the TVM solver. We'll enter all these values here except PV for present value. N is equal to the total number of compounds over the 15 years. Because you're taking annual withdrawals of $35,000, we also assume the interest is compounded annually. So if the interest is compounded annually for 15 years, N would be 15 times one or just 15. If it was compounded quarterly, it would be 15 times four. If it was compounded monthly, it would be 15 times 12. The interest rate is 5%, so we enter five for the interest rate, enter. The present value we're solving for, so we'll come back to this. So we'll press enter for now. The payment is going to be $35,000, so we enter 35,000, enter. The future value after the 15 years will be zero, enter. Payments per year, again that's one per year, so we enter one for P slash Y. This automatically changes the compounds per year to one, which again we're assuming is correct. Now we go back up to present value, which we're solving for, and we press alpha, enter. Notice how it's negative, because you have to pay this amount today in order to withdraw $35,000 each year for the next 15 years. So for part A, how much do you need in your account at the beginning? Again, that would be $363,288.03. Part B, how much total money will you pull out of the account? Well, that would be $35,000 a year for 15 years. So the total money pulled out of the account would be $35,000 times 15. So going back to the home screen by pressing second mode, 35,000 times 15 is equal to 525,000. And then finally in part C, how much of that money is interest? Well you made a one-time deposit of this amount in order to withdraw $35,000 once a year for 15 years, which came out to $525,000. So the difference between these two amounts would be the interest earned. So going back to the calculator, 525,000 minus 363,288 dollars and three cents is equal to $161,711.97, which is the total interest earned. Okay, I hope you found this helpful.